Hello, welcome to my channel. Today we have a John Doe found in College Park, Georgia, February 23rd, 2000. Estimated age 35 to 45. Estimated PMIs five years. It said he could have died anywhere from 1995 to 2000. Uh, estimated height is five foot eight. Could not estimate the weight. Skeletal remains found in a wooded area. Doesn't give the streeter any information about the area. Several hundred yards behind a residential cul-de-sac by a survey crew. Not recognizable, near complete or complete skeleton. Doesn't have the color of hair or anything like that. Denim pants degraded, no size. T-shirt, no size, no color. Empty wallet, no description. Nike shoes, no color, no size. Here's a picture of what he may have looked like. Here is where College Park is, right here in this area. You can see there's East Point, there's Union City, there's Atlanta. And we'll look at some missing persons. We have Daniel Cable. No picture, not even a school picture. Missing since December 28, 1996 from Marietta, Georgia. 5'7", 120 pounds. Um, last seen at the Marietta Greyhound bus station. On South Marietta Parkway. Brown hair, blue eyes, possible beard and a mustache. No clothing description. And Alvin Dell Giddens. Here's a picture of what he looked like. He's been missing since September 6, 1996 from Marietta. It says he's 5 foot 10 to 6 foot tall, which is a little bit too tall. And last seen by a friend. Evidence at his residence indicates foul play. Brown hair, green eyes. No clothing or transportation information. Um, last one that I have is all the way from Kentucky. He was 5'8", 220 pounds. That's pretty far away. June 24th, 1999, Smiths Grove, Kentucky. Um... Unknown circumstances, beard and mustache, blue eyes, gray wildcats, t-shirt, black shorts, Adidas tennis shoes, that's not Nikes, Redman camouflage cap, he had a minivan, minivan, 1986 Chevy Astro van, and here's a picture of what he looked like, which kind of reminded me of the John Doe, so I wanted to leave him in there. But, you know, this John Doe could be somebody that wasn't even reported missing. It could have been somebody traveling through the area because there's a main airport there. If you have any information about who it might be, please contact authorities and let them know. If you have any information about any of these missing persons, also contact them with that information. Even if you gave them information years ago, you're not sure if they still have it. You heard it from somebody drinking and talking. You're not sure if it's truthful you're not sure if it's relevant you feel like it's hearsay it's not like you're going to testify in a court of law any information that you have please give them give it to the authorities let them decide what's relevant and what's important don't forget to pray for their families and their loved ones because each of these people is somebody's son it could be somebody's dad somebody's uncle it's somebody's loved one um feel free to leave comments and have a blessed day Bye bye